When I joined Bradford Teaching Hospitals on the 1st of November, never did I envisage that a few short months later I'd be preparing this organisation to deal with a pandemic. Thank you to all the businesses, the schools, voluntary groups and individuals who have supported our hospital staff through this crisis so far. We have received thousands of donations from hand cream to cooked meals, knitted hearts, to the offer of the use of people's own houses. We're grateful for everything you have done to show your support and solidarity. We will always be grateful for the kindness and generosity shown by the people of Bradford. Bradford Teaching Hospitals are your hospitals and we will repay you by providing the exceptional treatment and care that you all deserve. Thank you. This is a sincere thanks to all the people and businesses of Bradford for all your support during the course of the coronavirus crisis. It's been really appreciated. You've been with us right from the start and indeed our NHS Heroes Appeal has reached just about £100,000 now from the people and businesses of Bradford. It's terrific news. My promise to you as chairman of this hospital trust is that we will continue to provide the very best services, outstanding services that we can to you here in this great city. That's my promise. So thank you again very much to the people of Bradford. And I think uh, Francis wants to have the last word. What do you want to say, Francis? Thank you, people of Bradford. Thank you, people of Bradford. Thank you. Thank you. Shukriya. Shukriya. Thank you. Shukriya. Salamat. Thank you. Shukriya. Thank you.